Mr. Know-it-all. I can't stand inane toddler music. But am I impairing my two-year-old's cognitive development by spinning Zeppelin instead of the Wiggles? As long as you keep your kid from seeing the Houses of the Holy cover art, her brain will be just fine. There is exactly zero evidence that one kind of music helps cognitive development more than any other. Plus, the supposed benefits of music come from learning to play an instrument, not just kicking back and admiring John Bonham's drum solo in Moby Dick. I certainly agree that Do the Monkey by the Wiggles belongs right next to the Barney and Elmo theme songs on Volume 1 of Beelzebub's Greatest Hits. But don't forget the first tenet of parenthood. It's not about you. Toddler tunes sell because their simple lyrics and catchy melodies make rugrats boogie and sing and spark a lifelong appreciation for music. So if your tyke digs the kitty pap more than physical graffiti, suck it up. A little wiggles now may pain your ears, but it could mean a whole lot of love for the better stuff down the line. I'm Mr. Know-It-All, which means I already know whether or not you are interested in clicking on the subscribe button. You are. <laughs>